All right, so um, hello. Um, I'm gonna be up unboxing some packages again. I have three over here of just small eBay orders, and I also have one from Gunin. And yeah, after that, I'll I'll be taking shorter reviews on some mods that I built from the last order, which uh, all the stuff should be in the description. Oh gosh, I just hit the. Well, first one. This one should be just like two pens over here. This one is from Japan? Yeah, from Japan. Cool. So, we're just gonna take a look. There, it's all wrapped in tape and plastic stuff. But, I just cut my nails. This is, we're just gonna rip this up. And let's see what it is. That's a lot of plastic wrap. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Um so I see writing. What is it gonna be? Um so now we have some bubble wrap. And unboxing it turns out to be some Pentel V Feel 3s. Um, also, these are the ones that are uh, going to be used in Nectalios, which is cool. These were pretty expensive, though. Like, damn, I, this is the only place I could find them. Everywhere else, like, so. Like, everywhere else didn't have any. We're like, I don't know. All the places were like, Extreme shipping for, from the US or something, so that's kind of a bra. Um, but Ooh. wow, okay. Uh, so yeah, I guess that's cool. Now I have those to make Nectalios, except I don't have every other part. I still need to apply Stalogies from somewhere. Well, over here now, where, uh, this one's from Britain, for another eBay order. Here we have a package of, um, from bubble wrap. This is some nice, like, tinted bubble wrap. Oh, because it's from the mailer itself. Oh, how cool. Oh. So here we have... A box of Pentel I feel it's which oh uh, these are gonna be used for some just uh, I don't know I I tried buying uh, HGGs on eBay but Hong Kong doesn't ship to Canada anymore during the pandemic so I bought these um, yeah pretty much so I bought a pack of these pretty cool yeah oh good. yeah Oh, just all black. So now I can make some uh, some MXV2s uh, because I can get VPs here in Canada. So this is the last package from Gunin um, that I'll just be opening it up real quick. Um, he messaged me to trade. He wanted he I, I gave away my my mango uh, rubber emboss so. Yeah, oh shoot, I don't want to look at some stuff in there. Okay, I just hit that. Whoops. So, we're just gonna get that out of the way. But here we have um, a yellow Pro Gear, which is MX. <laughs> yellow Pro Gear MX with HGG tip. And damn, that yellow does not match. I guess, when does yellow ever match, man? We have a. A purple metallic uh, sunburst as a freebie. We have uh, we have a, a plastic bag, and we have oh we have a pack of uh, what is this? Oh, a pack of Fashion G twos, which I actually don't remember paying for. Actually, I was interested in this, but then I ended up not buying them. Maybe, or maybe I did. Who knows? But I guess that could be a freebie. Here we have a bag uh, from Gunin. Oh, these are his freebies. Uh, well, these purple things are freebies, so why is the bag? Okay, the bag is the bag is ripped. 
Um, well, that sucks. And here we have one of these. These are like whack, like uh, kindergarten grips that you'd find at like a dollar store. How cool. We have a pink uh, HCG grip. Uh, one HCG tip that that is a freebie. Um, I keep shaking. Um, one uh, purple, I mean, <laughs> green. One green body that's a little like chalky, chalky grippy, but it's very thin. I have a white HGG that I did pay for, and a, an HGG tip that I paid for, and a comms a back plate that I paid for, and one of these, which I have no clue what this is, but this just, damn, okay. Oh, and I have, I asked for it. I asked for a, a signature from him, so now I have a Gunin signature, which is pretty cool, you know. I'm pretty satisfied with that. Well. Here we go, we have one half of um, an Isook emboss. Oh my God, this connection kind of sucks. Like there's a there's like a space between it, which is kind of a bra. Here we have um, a purple G2, which I don't remember paying for, so I'll just consider that a freebie. Wait, what? This is purple. It looks kind of blue on the camera. What? I swear it's purple, man. Okay, it's purple, yeah. Oh my gosh, now it's blue? Okay, I'm tripping. Maybe it's my screen or something. But here we have, oh gosh, I hit the camera again. Whoopsie daisy. Here we have a body. Like what the heck is this? What is this? Is this emboss? This is not emboss. This is like thinner than emboss. ST? Black ST? Interesting. Interesting. A lot of freebies so far. Oh, we have a a nice Keiko green. It has Keiko on the side. It's like pink. That's pretty cool. Damn, a lot of freebies so far already. Wow, and I thought I gave I gave a lot of freebies too, so it's, it's, it's pretty cool. I'm pretty satisfied with that. I'm not complaining. Oh, here we have my uh, wow modern UX a Giotto X, which seems to have Giotto um, Doctor Grips and uh, Doctor Grip Tips inside with center. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I guess I've never had a Giotto. I haven't built a Giotto based body before. So, oh, here we, here is the, the big item that I kind of wanted, which is the, um, a Miffy and Melanie type, um, Miffy, Miffy and Melody, uh, mod from Vortex that he got, which, wow. Okay. My first time holding mod like you know you know it's kind of kind of kind of nice to think that vortex has held this mod wow how cool how 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 epic oh this is a sticky note damn kind of a bro i just wanted some piece of paper but oh my gosh this connection like wow it's so bad <laughs> it's so bad like damn we're gonna put this in there we go oh my gosh it's bent as heck damn okay this is just a bent i suck emboss holy moly damn and these are also this is from uh oleg too so um yeah that's kind of a bra. So these are super grip grips instead of Lakubo and um, the wrong kind of air fits. These are like Eno air fit or whatever. So yeah, we have that. Oh, and we have a, a Muji Hex. That is cool. I've never held a Muji Hex. Pretty awesome. Well, looks like there you go. That is the package. Damn. 
free Muji Hex, by the way. All freebie. How cool. I paid for these, and that's it. And then this, wow, that's a lot. I'm pretty satisfied with that. Well, we're going to jump into the mods that I have built, and I'll just talk about them real quick. First, we start off with uh, ZW or ZW1001 or V1 or whatever. And basically, all there is to say is it's um, I got it because I saw Dark T spin it, and RPD also tweeted about it a while ago, saying that this mod is probably good because Dark T spin it in like World, uh, world Tournament and stuff like world tournament 17 and stuff so um yeah um i also saw mr pearl spin it and i i don't know i think one of his combos i really liked it and so i got this mod because it's pretty cheap and uh, i wanted to try it out i guess you could say it spins similarly to the other the other good zw mod like this one and it's, it's uh, not the exact same, but it's good like this. Both emboss bodied. Oh, like emboss thickness and stuff. And yeah, pretty much. <laughs> uh, I honestly prefer to have these grips removed because I kind of I kind of suck. So I feel like rings make my, my spin suck. And yeah. Um, uh, I guess you could say slippery at times. I felt like... Um, I felt like I, I actually this is the first mod I used the nope wax on and but it's kind of messy so I don't use it anymore and I guess with slippery with the nope wax though it kind of made me like grip the mod more and tense up a bit um I felt like the nope wax kind of like made me get into the zone more for some reason I guess I'll say same with like when I wash my hands or something I feel like I get in the zone way easier like when I want to spin and stuff I think this mod, though, back to the mod, um, I feel like it ver it looks very cool. It looks very good when spinning it. Um, uh, like, you know, I, I think I kind of, I think the kind of spinning is like, it makes me kind of feel like, um, I don't know. It's, I feel like if you spin like um, uh, a genus gospel, you'll kind of, you'll kind of have a style that would fit this mod perhaps i don't know if motion but like yeah it's kind of like that i get maybe because like emboss bodies but like whatever um i think this has like a one to one a weight to length ratio but like almost i think this has like 21 like point like 8 21.7 something like that uh without the ink and then like this this whole thing is like 22 centimeters but i think mine is actually like 22.2 to be exact um yeah, I felt like, hmm, I guess sometimes I felt like it, it looks longer when spinning just because, I don't know, maybe like the design and stuff and how it's like this, these grips are almost like flush with the body. And yeah, I feel like it definitely spins better without the, the ink inside. Of course, with all ZWs, I feel like it does. And uh, when I first spin it, because of course it's kind of dense, heavier on the heavier side, it, it did make my hands feel wet. I mean, feel dry. Um, I felt like at times I don't want to spin this mod when I have dry hands, and sometimes I might feel like unmotivated or like it's kind of boring when spinning it. And so, like sometimes I just wish that the body was like just better. I feel like that could be a deal breaker, but I think this is one of the best factory made mods that you can buy. And the final verdict is, I guess, I kind of, you know, I, I do recommend it. Um, at times, I feel like I kind of want to spin it for like long sessions, but I can't because I kind of like start hating myself because of the slipperiness. And just when you pick up another mod from spinning this, I feel like that's just so relieving, to be honest. Like, especially if it's a like grippy mod, I like damn you know <laughs> like wow that, that that is a good feeling <laughs> um perhaps with this sometimes i i uh what i wrote is i felt like frustrated tense when i want to spin it and like when i spun this mod and i like just wanted to spin something else but when i went back to this mod like oh it, it, it's a nice it's a nice you know it's kind of 
and like damn like the grips hide these tips too and like it's, it's nice and you know i felt like just washing my hands i don't know why but washing my hands make this like just make me want to spin this more too probably because i can like ignore the body more but yeah um overall recommended okay next mod spinning this out of the way we're gonna get with the sakura element which is like damn initial impressions like i just think it is it is very like attractive to like new people like it's pink and it has flowers and stuff and it's just wow like i don't think i don't think if you like they look at like something like this or something they might like think this is like whoa so attractive so good so good looking you know this is something i feel like they could appreciate um so i guess why did i get this mod i got this mod because i wanted to try it out and it was limited edition but it was kind of pretty expensive at where i got it from from kevin and stuff but compared to this like oh yeah also the rings are gone because like just look at these rings i don't like them they, like even when these were like this kind of toned out like less i just i think they i i prefer it on my hands if it wasn't <laughs> If it did not have the grips, because when I notice the grips, I kind of just notice them and like, yeah. Um, so this is this is three grams lighter, at uh, 22 grams, and it kind of feels slippery, plasticky, kind of like the other element. It, it's pretty much the same except lighter, but yeah, it's kind of cheap-ish. I feel like I think the connector will break, and this paint will. I mean, this like tape will come off printing. And, um, yeah, um, it kind of, uh, I feel like it's pretty expensive. Like, why would I get this when I, for the same price, I could buy like so many other mods. Like, damn, like why would, like, I don't know. Like, I don't feel like the price, the performance is that good. And also feel like it kind of like, I don't know, but like when you think of Chinese spinners, you kind of think um you know kind of like heavyish mods like this this kind of feels like a chinese mod this, like the the, the 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 previous mod i reviewed was of course chinese and stuff you think of uh Jigaos and uh, um stuff like that they're all like pretty heavy thick you, the supreme mod is also like i don't know i don't think light rsvp mx uh metal comms of spinners when i think of i think like vgg emboss and stuff like that or Isaac and Bus, um, when I think of Chinese spinners generally. So I feel like I wrote down it looks and feels Chinese. <laughs> Not to like, you know, uh, but yeah. I think, though, spinning this mod because of the long and thin body, um, well, like length of the whole mod, not not like long body or whatever, but um, I think I think it um, I think generally it makes my hands and like m makes me feel like good. It makes me feel cool. It makes my fingers longer. When I handed this to my friend though, it kind of made he, she said it was slippery, and that he thought it it, it looked cool though. It, he actually did not notice that it was the the same model as the Nope Element. To but uh, to be fair, he probably doesn't know what a Nope Element is and probably didn't connect these two because he probably didn't remember it too often. But basically, I really like it. Um, uh, I kind of felt like I want to sit down and learn FL for once. And grinding on it feels good. But I don't feel, I don't, I don't, I don't know. It's kind you kind of, I think you can finally kind of, if you felt like a normal element, you probably will kind of have an idea of what this will feel like. It's kind of, I, I don't think it's main worthy for a lot of people. I think for some people... Like, um, perhaps like, you know, um, if you're like a fanboy or something or you like the look, uh, I think you can spin it and you can do very well with it. Well, you can do very well with anyone, but I don't, I feel like it could fit the niche for some people. And I don't, I don't mind that. I feel like there are other better mods that will perform that are more price friendly, that are just, you know, like more customizable, more adjustable, more, um, just, just better to try out than this mod right here. I don't think it's. I don't think I don't see somebody switching over and having this their main up mod for like for years. I don't I, I don't know. Uh, maybe because it doesn't last long, but a lot of people said they like effect and definitely like this mod a lot and stuff. 
And yeah, I don't, I don't know. So, um, next mod we have is um, the Adjusai Kamza, which, damn, I'm kind of running. It's already been 20 minutes, damn, but like, Adjusai Kamza, I felt, I originally had no any balls because Mango said that Adjusai had gate any ball. But I put a few, I put two. Um, but I used that none, and I guess some people have four, some people have three, but like I don't even know how we're supposed to have them on. Like I think a, the original one had like electrical tape, but like that's kind of ugly, and like it had three like down here too, so it was kind of weird, and like no store sold it that way for some reason. Some some stores just decided, oh hey, I put like three or whatever. Like Oleg had, um. Like like some like like some had three, some had four, some had even five, and I only did two. Just I don't know, but I, I don't know. I had two lying around, two stripes. Um, basically, also the length is kind of skewed in some areas. Uh, some like uh, pen modding the PM had it as twenty one centimeters. This one had this is twenty two, and Oleg and Penstock and other resources had it as twenty two centimeters too. I might have to shorten this though if I figure out which one I I like better I guess or which one is more used. But yeah, um, I don't know. Maybe I think any balls I kind of add to the silhouette of the spin effect if you spin it a certain way. So I, I'm not a big fan of it. Like I want to make this this kind of like I don't know. I think it's kind of uglier. But yeah, I guess um, also for general shops have it as. 14 grams, this one is only 12.5, which is cool. Um, I, I also got this mod because, um, you know, um, Alex, he said that this is a super mod for super smooth and stylish spinning, and that in his uh, emboss PC2, and it just say, because he kind of misspelled at just I, um, he could say that at least one of those two mods has to be in every collection of every pen spinner with self-respect and I think I want self-respect so you know I I made this mod and yeah um I guess uh it's okay um Alex yeah Alex picked I just like comms over emboss pieces too so I picked that too so yeah um I guess spinning it you could say it's unstable high momentum light of course general stuff I don't know Alex already has like a video on this but like you know it's kind of you know yeah um, it's kind of it's kind of boring to be honest it's kind of like you know I don't feel like it has like I don't feel like it's so unique I feel like I don't know it's kind of boring maybe it's like too much too much like momentum too much like unstableness and like it is cheap though but I don't see it becoming like someone's main mod I don't see somebody spinning it like forever and like I feel like it's just eh, it's not that I don't I don't want to spin this I don't want to spin this but I can spin it that's how I like feel the vibes with it it's like one of those mods that you have in your collection that you could whip out for like one of those off combos that you know and I think you can do like you could you'll like the mod at that one time for like one combo but never spin it again <laughs> because you know it's just it's just, uh, it's just uh, i generally i recommend it though because it's pretty cheap and yeah it, i think it's something that you can try and i think it, it wouldn't be wrong to try it yeah uh next mod i have is uh goat flexible mx which is generally good i guess because i i got it because Terra Pob, uh, Indian guy wanted me to make it, <laughs> and yeah, I I used I don't have G line, so I used High Tech C, the closest option, I think, or at least I think it's like the same way or something. I don't know, but like G line's like rare or whatever. So yeah, um, I didn't I did not tape the front side though, so it might rattle it a little, which kind of messes me up, or I me mean, I like I, it just doesn't feel good when something rattles, you know, it just kind of sucks. <laughs> I also used any um, Papermate profile for the front and the hard ones, so that might be. But I, in theory, hard will like keep it in together, less rattly. Blah, 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 blah. But like, 
you know, I don't know. I guess that's not really true. I guess like tighter ones would be better at holding, but yeah, I don't know what I think they're the same, man. Who cares? Um, I don't know. I guess spinning it, I really I did like spinning it. Um, but I felt like maybe it was boring at times. But and I think I had a lot of fun with other SCs. Or maybe it's the color scheme itself. Like I enjoyed this um this whack little uh I see from Jay a lot better. Because I don't know, I, I guess it's just more my style. Maybe I don't like black um uh comms on. Maybe I just you know, but it's I also wanted it because uh, Tom Buto's black SC. I, I liked his aesthetic of that. So I wanted a black SC for myself. And um, yeah, I just don't get the urge to spin it. But if I bring it out, I will spin it and I'll like like it in my head, I guess. Do I recommend? I don't know. It's kind of it's kind of eh. it's kind of cool. I think it's cool. If you like goat, I don't really like goat. So that might be why I don't want to spin this and I don't like um, it's just, it's just, yeah. I think it's generally good. I think it's growing on me though. I, I like, I, I like the more I spin this, the more I want to spin this, the more I keep going out. But like, after a while, I just don't want to spin it. I just want to spin other stuff. Maybe because I have too many mods. But I don't see. I can see why it's not that popular. You know? Yeah. Last mod I have is um, Coffee Lucky's DC, aka Super Lucky, which. Um, in my opinion, it looks thicker than it actually is. It's only ST, but I just felt like maybe the construction makes it look thicker. I generally think it's good. I feel like the Eno any balls though, they don't match. Like, what is this? What is this? Oh my gosh. Like, it... damn, I think it's worth trying, except the caps are kind of a pain to buy if you're not willing to get a whole set. Although, if you get the caps for this, they all come in a 10 pack or like a 12 pack and it's like what like it's it's still pretty cheap it's like what like 10 usd for like a whole pack you can also use that to make mods like this which is um clyde's uh superior super tip superior st and you can make something like this which is like old um clyde's like uh clyde sc clyde superior sc which sc stands for small cap not single capped <laughs> but yeah um, those are cool mods. I really like the Superior SC. I think it's worth it. I think it's honestly one of my favorite mods. Um, my version, my specific one has Dr. Grip, Grips over gripped and signal tips instead of what he used because he, but he said like these are subs for that. But, like you can use that and I did that and I really like it and I think it's good to try and I think this mod is a good set to have with that. I think it's it's just honestly my mod my mine mine <laughs> mine is only 13.7 grams when it's supposed to be 14 or 15 and I don't know why I use glow in the dark Dr. Grip grips because they are lighter and he said in his tutorial that he used uh, something that was lighter and I asked him and he did use dark, uh, glow in the dark ones so I wanted to use the glow in the dark ones too but mine came out lighter so I guess I'm spinning lighter but I feel like if this was a little heavier it would feel awesome I might main it if it was a little heavier because I don't know it just feels it just feels nice it just like it's my favorite light mod at the moment and it's very cheap and it's overall I think it's recommended um yeah I get maybe I just I don't know. It's just it. It feels good. It it just I I want to spin it. Perhaps it might be a little boring, but I really like it. Um, I don't know. It's just wow. When I just wanna, it kind of makes my fingers like tense up, I guess, at times. But I don't know. Maybe because I'm trying to spin fast with it. But I I honestly feel like I could relax down like Coffee Lucky and spin this. Maybe because of the t oh yeah never mind, I, I I honestly really like it. Yeah, like wow. It makes me want to spin like him, you know. It has that vibe, of course. Well, like anything, anything kind of makes you want to spin like whoever made it, I guess you know. Which is I like that. Yeah, and um, I think generally that's it. Wow, I spent thirty minutes talking. Oh my gosh. Well, see ya guys. I, I'm dead. <laughs>